Hi guys, welcome back to your bonus YouTube challenge. Um, a couple of kids asked if I would do a Grand Canyon book in the Grand Canyon. So um, what you're looking at right now is the Grand Canyon. It's absolutely huge. It's absolutely beautiful. And if you look way off in the distance, you can actually see the Colorado River. Um, I hope everybody's having a great Thanksgiving break. If you choose to participate in this YouTube challenge, uh, then uh, you'll get five Starbucks for passing the AR test and five Starbucks for your awesome journals that you're gonna write. So the book that I'm gonna read to you is called That's Good, That's Bad in the Grand Canyon. Bear with me guys, it's a little windy up here. As one day, a little boy and his grandmother rode to the Grand Canyon for their summer vacation. Oh, that's good. Nope, that's bad. I want you to pay attention to the pattern in the book because I'm going to ask you to write your own that's good, that's bad journal. As they hiked down Bright Angel Trail, I just hiked that, the little boy was careless. Oh dear, he slipped and fell over the edge of the path. Oops. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. He dropped onto the back of a mule, giddy up, that was walking down the switchbacks at the bottom of the canyon. What luck! Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. Look at his face. Does the mule like that? The mule was so startled that he sped down the trail as fast as he could go, clippity clop. The boy held on tight. He jounced and bounced until his teeth rattled and his knees shook, clappity clack. Oh, that's bad. Colorado River. All the way down in the distance, guys, can you see the Colorado River? It says trot, trot. When it reached the edge, it stopped suddenly. The little boy was thrown over its head into the raft, being paddled by a group of friendly tourists. Swish, swish. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. The raft drifted into some choppy rapids. The little boy yelled and hollered, help, as the boat flew over the side into the foamy water. Splash! Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. The current swept the little boy along and tossed him onto a sandy beach. A helicopter was rescuing some visitors whose boat had capsized. Oopsie daisy. The little boy's backpack got caught on the runner and he was lifted up, up, and away. Whoosh! Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. As the helicopter picked up speed, the little boy's pack slipped free. Uh-oh, he fell toward the rocky cliff in the valley below. Eee! Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. Do you see how they keep switching the events from being good to bad? He landed on a waterfall. Splish splash. He slid down the slippery falls. Wee! To the beautiful pool below. What fun. Oh, that's good. No. That's bad. The water churned and whirled at the bottom of the falls. Bish bash. The little boy was thrown under the surface. He spun around the surface, spun around as if he were inside a washing machine. I love that simile. Trilla, trilla. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. How could that be good? Oh, I have a spawny Indian fish the little boy out of the water. Thank goodness. He set the little boy on the back of a horse and led um, him on the trail to Suwapi Village. Clip clop. Oh, that's good. Nope, that's bad. The horse stepped on a rattlesnake that was sunning itself on a rock by the path. Rattle, rattle. The horse galloped up the path to the village. Jugga, jugga. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. The little boy's grandmother was waiting for him at the top of the trail. Hooray! The Havasapi had radioed ahead that the little boy was all right. Whew. The grandmother was so happy to see him. She gave him a big hug. Ooh. And then another one. Wow. Oh, that's good. Yes, that is good. She set the little boy on her shoulders, and that's where he stayed for the rest of vacation. You see the Grand Canyon, guys? Okay, so what I want you to do for your YouTube challenge, if you 
can choose to is you can write your own that's good, that's bad journal. Um, it can be about the Grand Canyon or it can be about something that you did on your, your uh, Thanksgiving vacation or it can just be a fun story that you make up. Try to have a couple that's good, that's bad switches and I can't wait to see what you guys come up with after Thanksgiving break. I'll see you guys on Monday. Bye.